You know, I think on the surface it looks like kind of like a, a mentor-student relationship or something like that. It's not like that at all. Um, genuinely, I think of them as everybody as peers, um, and we just talk it out, you know, all the time. So um, if there's a difference of opinion, hey, I think we should shoot this instead of that, I'll say, you know, I'll articulate my opinion, and then they'll artic articulate their opinion. Um, and it's really been a really kind of very equal playing field, and that's what I wanted. I wanted a um, equality and, and, and you know, stimulation of ideas. Um, I didn't want to dictate, and uh, I want to learn as much as, as anybody uh, in, this, in this process. Devil kind of came from like long, you know, EPK interviews like this from a long time ago where they were like, well, you know, w you know, what do you think about Hitchcock and all this stuff? I was like, you know, it's amazing. He, he invokes so much stuff that you could just say his name and you could put anything on. You could say, you know, Alfred Hitchcock's The Elevator and it would cause you to think of something. And I, I just said that once in an interview and then I was in the hotel room going, what would that movie be? <laughs> and then I started writing notes about it, literally. And then I, I had this Hitchcock book I was reading and I was writing notes about what it could be, that, that story, and then it became Devil. <laughs> it was the idea of uh, five people trapped in an elevator. Uh, one of them turns out to be the devil and they get killed off one by one until you realize who the devil is. Uh, and that kind of, you know, uh, the ten little Indians of it was really provocative and then just feeling an elevator stop. And then, you know, you, you normally in an elevator you don't look at anybody and then the door opens and you go. But suddenly, you know, you have to look at everybody and who am I in this little space with? And then when the first bad thing happens, uh, all the 